Welcome to Bella Colin Fair Party and today I'm talking about the loss of our Collingwood boys against St Kilda. It was this devastating. It was appalling. It was heartbreaking to see that our Collingwood boys lost. We should have won that game yesterday. If we kicked straight, we could have won that game yesterday. But it was appalling. It was shocking. It was devastating. It was like heartbreaking. I'm lost for words. I'm lost for words. I have no idea what to say about our AFL team against St Kilda yesterday. It was really... I was shocked. I was shocked, I was shocked, I was shocked. I had no idea what to say. It was appalling. Now we've got Richmond next this week. Don't know when we play Richmond, but we've got Richmond this week and I hope we can beat Richmond. Richmond, I fucking hate Richmond, all right? I fucking hate Richmond. Um, because I just don't like Richmond at all. And Richmond, we are gonna fucking beat you guys. We are gonna fucking beat you. But I will talk about that more to when it comes. But to yesterday's match was appalling. It was a terrible, pathetic match. Upsetting. It upset me to watch it on TV. I was watching it first quarter and second quarter. To the third quarter, I couldn't even watch the third quarter or the fourth quarter at all. At all, at all, at all. I couldn't even watch it. I couldn't even watch it. I was like nerve wracking, thinking, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, St Kilda. We can do this. I'm sorry. Come on, Collingwood. We can do this. We can do this. We can beat St Kilda. But it was appalling yesterday. It was shocking. It was devastating. It was heartbroken. I'm still upset peed off that we lost by nine points against St Kilda but we were happy that we won the VFL but mainly it's to do with the AFL and I am just heartbroken I have no literally no what to say uh, except for I'm just devastated I'm lost for words we should have won that match yesterday against St Kilda if we kicked straight instead of diagonal into the points we should have kicked very straight and if we kicked that last goal very straight or whatever it was straight we could have won we could have bet St Kilda we should have won that match last night it was yesterday it was a pathetic very pathetic game very pathetic game and it's and as as a and as a um Collingwood supporter I take my I'm passionate about my team I love my Collingwood boys I'm very passionate about my Collingwood team I take my Collingwood team to heart I take my team to heart yes I may swear in that because it shows passion that I love my Collingwood boys and to see them lose yesterday against the Kilda, it's heartbreaking. It's devastating. I'm lost for work. I have no idea what to say. We need to start rebuilding up. We did that before Nathan Buckley left. We started rebuilding and becoming a good club when we played against Adelaide. And then we played against Melbourne before Nathan Buckley left us. And then we had a bye. After our bye, that's when we crumbled. We crumbled last week, and then again this week. We can't afford to lose again. Whoever our coach is, it doesn't matter who our coach is, as long as that we can get our Collingwood team back to where that was. We built. We built, and we can win more games next year. Maybe this year we don't have a chance. I know we don't have a chance to win the finals. To go in the finals. No way. 
the VFLW, yes, we made the semi-finals in the VFL, maybe. Um, we're in the top eight of the VFL anyway, so we'll make it to the finals. For the AFL, we need a good coach that can coach us to rebuild us to where we were before Abai, before Nathan Buckley left. We need to get that back up. I just hope we have a better year next year, next season, than this season, whoever our coach is. Um, a lot of people want um, Sam Mitchell. I want Sam Mitchell or Mark Williams, but I don't know who our coach is going to be for next season. But whoever it is, we need somebody that knows their stuff about Collingwood, they can help rebuild our club up and to perform better, to win, win, win. Win, 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 not lose. This year is a bad year. We've won some games and then we lost some games. It's heartbreaking to see when we lose every week. As a Collingwood supporter, it makes me upset. It hurts me right inside me. It makes me really hurt to see my Collingwood team, our Collingwood boys, my Collingwood boys, to lose every week. We need a coach that can rebuild our club the way it should be when we won against Adelaide. We won against Melbourne Demons. Now we've got Richmond, and we want to beat Richmond. I fucking hate Richmond. I fucking hate Richmond. But I'll talk about that next week. But it's just heartbreaking to see Collingwood lose yesterday. It's appalling. I'm lost for words. All right. If you like this video, please subscribe to me. And go to Pies. Go to Pies for 21. Hope we can do better next week. Bye.